Neil Holmes is a fully trained nurse and spends his days on building sites making sure all the workers are looking after themselves. But alongside his 9-5 job he does something totally different and very unusual, he works as an Adolf Hitler look-alike. While he admits he doesn't always tell everyone about the unusual sideline as he's not sure how some people will react, he thoroughly enjoys the work and earns and pound, 500 for as little as 10 minutes work. He mostly does comedy work in TV shows and films but he's had some weird requests over the past 15 years. There's also one type of job he would always refuse regardless of who was asking. Speaking to Mirror Online, Neil said, It's certainly a weird claim to fame. It's a bit of escapism. It's certainly very different. It's a fun day out. I do have to be very careful who I show the pictures to. I did show a picture to a German once and he was very offended because he thought it was actually Hitler. Neil, 55 who now works with Susan Scott lookalikes, used to do impressions when he was a teenager at school, including Hitler. Years later he decided to dress up in the uniform and send some photos off to an agency to see if he could get any work. He said, I got work within about three weeks of sending in my picture. He mainly does walk on comedy and TV shows and films, including the IT crowd and Bees Make Honey. Neil, who lives in London, also auditioned for a piece in The Crown, however the scene was cut during the early stages. Over the years he had a variety of jobs but there has only been one he really didn't want to do. He was once contacted by a man who was trying to organize a speech for his dad's wedding and he had the idea of hiring Hitler and Churchill lookalikes to have an argument during the wedding reception. I would have been pretty loath to do it. I would have felt a little bit uncomfortable, Neil explained. Maybe some of the people would have found it inappropriate. He says he would consider doing stag parties if asked but he would ask his agency to thoroughly investigate the group beforehand to check their motives. But there is one kind of job Neil claims he would also refuse without even considering any appearances for any sort of right-wing group. He said, if there was even any suspicion of that I just wouldn't do it. I wouldn't want to be an icon with some group of right-wing losers. He's also had inquiries about going into school as part of history lessons to act as a visual learning aid but nothing has taken off yet. His dream is to appear in a historical TV series. To get into character Neil used lots of brill cream on his hair to get Hitler's famous style. He buys the mustache from costume shops. But he says most of the work is in his facial expressions. He said, it's in the eyes. He didn't look at people he looked through them. I always imagine I'm in a bad mood and sulking about something. One of the weirdest moments Niels had in the job was while filming a short scene in a movie. The whole cast and crew were given breakfast before filming began, but that meant Neil had to walk into a packed canteen in full makeup, hair and uniform. He said, it was a little embarrassing. Lots of people did double takes. Another interesting incident was when he was separated from group of extras while on set at Pinewood Studios, so was left walking around the studios dressed at Hilter, 